so we're super, great, super excited to have you guys here. Thanks for being here. Um, so this is kind of an open question for all of you guys. Obviously, with Ironton out, you guys kind of assume that top spot. A lot of high expectations coming into the season. Um, Coach, what have you seen from this team over the summer to kind of step into those shoes from last year? Well, they uh, bought in last year to our system, and we just continued in the off season. And I feel like we can be even just as explosive on the field as we was last year, if not have a chance to be even better. So, with a year under our belt, so I'm excited to see how they uh, how we respond in this week one. What do you guys think? Big up. Yeah, all right. Well, I mean, I think we're going to take a top spot pretty easily. Fortunately, last year didn't go the way we wanted to, but I mean, if we've been first game, I think we can do it again. So I'm ready. Yeah. And what worked for you guys last season as far as schemes, as far as chemistry, any of that? What worked for you guys? Just the run game. Our run game is strong. Our defense is strong. We got good linemen, fast skills, and we can play hard. So it works. And then speaking of running game, you guys have um, some kind of important names lead last year. What players have you guys seen kind of stepping up into those bigger roles? Uh, Lucas Bumpus, he stepped up quite a lot. He's made some, he's healthy now, so he's a big player. David Murray and Sandra Collins. And then are there, is there anything in specific that you're looking forward to about this season? Games, schedule, just being all together, that's it. Everything, really. Just Really excited to play. And then last season, you guys kind of ended kind of on a little bit of a sour note, especially with the playoffs. You know, Portsmouth regular season was fine, and then we had that overtime loss. What are we looking to improve on for last season? We're just making sure we tackle better because we would have tackled for Portsmouth. We could have went a couple more rounds, so if we can tackle, we'll make a good little run in the playoffs. Be more physical. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And then how important is that team chemistry that you guys have for the success of your team? It's really important, but we have really high team, temp, uh, team chemistry. We've played together since we were like six years old, so that's not a problem. We're really great. Do you guys have any games circled on your calendars? Uh, Portsmouth is a big one. Ironton's always in Portsmouth last week one. But yeah, and Chesapeake, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then, Coach, obviously, these guys, um, little. High expectations for them, obviously. Oh, yeah, they, all, they all three had a, a great junior year last year and just expect them to expand on this year. Um, they all three work hard, good teammates, uh, live in the weight. These two live in the weight room, these two right here. And Jack works out hard too, but uh, he didn't track to work on his speed, Jack did. So just, uh, I really look forward to seeing what they do in their senior year. What kind of growth have you seen from them as far as like, throughout their career? Oh, just, uh, with Jack, and we, we knew when he was a freshman that he was explosive, and uh, just to uh, let him understand the blocks of his line and, and not just rely on his uh, talent, let the talent around him help him out, and uh, don't go backwards like Jack, and <laughs> something like that. Well, he, he, he's gotten better at it, and, and uh, Quentin is just our, He's a hard on defense. He's he uh, plugs the whole plugs the run game for us, and uh, just a real solid football player. And then Will has just developed himself in. He's gotten so strong since he's a freshman. He's our we consider him our best lineman on the offense and defense side of the ball. So we expect our line, him to set the example for our linemen how they do for the season. Um, I guess I'll ask, you know, you guys obviously didn't end last season how you won it. Um, aside from just winning, I guess, what's what's the goal? You know, what are your um, sights set on? Like, uh, for example, all right, this is my goal, I hope, is uh, that they become positive citizens of society, you know, and, uh, and hopefully I have a smaller part of that, I hope. But just for example, a few weeks ago, Work busy, practice work, going get over the summer. I was aggravated, I ain't going to say about food or what, but had like a bad week, and it'd been a bad week to practice and work. And uh, one of my ex players, at, uh, going away to college, I come home, and there's a letter from him 
at my door just thanking me for what I did to him. So what I did for him. So things like that is what it means. That's what I hope for them. And what about you guys? What are your guys' goals down the line? Well, as many games as possible. We want to, you know, go as far as we can in the playoffs. We want to be all of our rivals, especially Ironton, as far as the biggest ones. So, yeah. That's all I have. Um, he talked about, Coach talked about um, how you ran, you ran track in the offseason to work on yeah. speed a little bit. Um, what, what was kind of each of the three of you, what was a, an individual point of emphasis? Um, to improve going into your final year. All right, like he said, I just want to keep getting faster and get stronger and just work out hard and just keep getting better. But, yeah. Mostly my like block destruction as a linebacker, getting off the blocks. Yeah, mostly just to build strength in the offseason, ready right for the year. Okay. Uh, Caleb. And from the audience, you guys have any questions for the, <laughs> any questions for the players? Put them on the spot, maybe. Nothing. I would like to know what Will thinks of uh, his brother being the siding on the line. No, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> <laughs> my dad might not be big down the road. Free parents is big. I mean, for down the road, 10 years from now, it'd be something cool for you. Put it back on, so mm-hmm. just enjoy it. Because uh, they'll be hopefully for you now, so just enjoy it. All right. Here we go. Thank you, guys. Thank you all. Thank you, guys. <laughs>